right now, preparations are underway at the U.S. Capitol for President Donald Trump's State of the Union address later tonight. Members of Rhode Island's congressional delegation will be attending the address with special guests, and we got to hear from one of them this afternoon. Eyewitness News reporter Anita Buffoni continues our local coverage live in studio. Anita? Well, Mike and Shannon, it's a tradition for members of Congress to bring a guest to the State of the Union. Congressman David Cicilline has invited an 18-year-old cancer survivor from Portsmouth who was diagnosed with a rare form of bone cancer last year. Now, Carrigan Nelson says because of the Affordable Care Act, she was able to get health insurance that covered her costly cancer treatments and surgeries. When Nelson's mother lost her health insurance through her job, they turned to Congressman Cicilline for help. He assisted Carrigan enroll in the state's health insurance exchange program program. Congressman Cicilline is using Carrigan's story as an example of how the ACA is working to get health insurance for individuals, including those with pre-existing conditions. This cancer can get extremely expensive, so it was really scary for a while. I had tons of scans coming up. I still had chemo. So with the ACA, we are extremely lucky. I don't know where I'd be without it. I wouldn't have insurance. I don't know if I would have been able to get my surgeries that removed my tumor. The President of the United States and the Republicans in the Congress are involved in a lawsuit right now to try to have the entire Affordable Care Act declared unconstitutional, which would result in 130 million Americans like Kerrigan who have pre-existing conditions. It will result in them losing their health insurance coverage. Now, as for the rest of Rhode Island's congressional delegation, Congressman Langevin is taking Takeo Comfort Solutions Chairman John Hazen White Jr. Senator Whitehouse is taking Coastal Medical President and CEO Dr. Alan Kuros, and Senator Reed is taking a mother and childhood cancer advocate Rebecca Ham of Providence. I'm Anita Buffoni, Eyewitness News.